Hi Vikings, I'm going to show you how you can import your VR VRM into Valheim, which is so exciting because I love Valheim and it's so great that we can use our avatar in the game, so I can't wait to share this with you. Here we go. Step 1, you'll go to this web address and download the zip file on GitHub. The link will be in the description. Step 2. In WinRAR, you'll open it up and you'll see Valheim VRM 1.0.12. Double click the BepinX plugins, BepinX data, and these are all going to be in your BepinX folder. Please feel free to pause at any time if you need to during this video. What you're going to do is go to the main folder in your game files called bepinex and drag these .dll files and shader files into the bepinex plugins folder in steam apps valheim folder as i'm doing here you just drag and drop them in there then go back to the main folder and click on the valheim data managed folder in your valheim data folder click on managed and you'll drag all the files into the managed folder as I'm doing here. And you're just going to go into the folder in the zip, copy all of these files, and drag them over into there. Okay. Go back to the main Valheim folder and there you will create a new folder and name this Valheim VRM with no spaces. Uh, and from the zipped folder, you'll drag over the settings underscore player dot txt file from the WinRAR and add it into the newly created folder. And uh, no spaces. So let's fix that. We can actually close our zip file now and we're going to be working in this Valheim VRM folder for the remainder this settings underscore player dot txt will have the same name as our Valheim character but first we need to go and find our VRM which actually will go in here as well and if you go into your documents folder under Vroid and the avatars folder you will find your VRMs we'll go to documents and Vroid and avatars and I have many VRMs in here so we'll just copy one of these Once we go into the Valheim VRM folder, I'm pasting my character name here and I'm going to change the name of the text file that we added from the zip to my Valheim character name, which will be Zeta Valheim for test. now they both match they must match perfectly including any spaces or whatever from here we will log into Valheim and test our test character out